but exposed as a bitch ass nigga, man. Caught red handed as a bitch ass nigga, man. Nobody wanted, nobody, that's that's very, you know, humbling. Right. You know what I'm saying? So just like your boy South Carolina, just like Nate. He's been exposed for a bitch ass nigga. T talking about, you know what I'm saying? You preaching and you speaking and edifying tremendously about the name of the Lord, right? And then you go and turn around and say the name of the Lord, you'll play yoga. You know why? Because you've been exposed as being a bitch, man. So you gotta go hard on some bullshit that you're presenting, man. And it, and it seems like they was, they're speaking with passion about what they're speaking. They're speaking with passion because they feel salty about how the elders getting on their fucking ass, man. Every single one of you niggas, man. That's the passion that you have because you fucking feel played, man. You've been exposed for being a, a whole ass nigga, man. Go ahead. It says, but these speak evil of those things which they know not, but what they know naturally as brute beasts. Yeah, no, 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 ain't nobody doing that to my daughter. That's me, you, you speaking naturally as brute beast. You know the, you ain't a real Israelite, man. You're not Israelites, right? You know? It's a law. It's basically a law on, on like, like uh, the brother Yashawama said, on, on the do's and don'ts and when you come across this situation. The Most High covered everything. That's what it was about. He covered everything. You know? It says, as brute beasts and those things, they corrupt themselves. Woe unto them, for they have gone in the way of Cain and ran greedily after the heir of uh, Balaam. Yeah, and Cain, what, what Cain was? Jealous of his brother for doing right, man. You know? All that hating that shit, man. Because what they, it's just... It, a, a brother in the know, a know just plain old hate, man. Is oh, you you a hate you hating on these dudes, man. That's what a brother from the outside will look at. But y'all say we hating on y'all, but y'all be constantly doing some shit that need to be talked about, man. You just sit there and say you get on Jim Mess for bringing out a doctrine that you don't agree with, but you're a group up with niggas that don't got the same doctrine as you, just because y'all cool and y'all ain't disrespecting each other. That's contradictive, man. Why ain't, why ain't you getting on Baloo? Why you ain't getting on Nate? You know what I'm saying? Why you ain't getting on this person, that person? You know what I'm saying? Why you trying to click up and have councils with these niggas, man? Somebody believe in a different name. Somebody believe in a chip. That was in that congregation. HODC, uh, uh, man. Okay? Believed in a chip. I believe they was there. I could be wrong. But there's basically the point is people believed in different doctrines, man. But you on GMS case, quote unquote, because they have a different doctrine. They speak in the wrong doctrine. No, you really on GMS case because GMS be getting in your shit, man. That's some old whole ass shit. That's a that's a that's what that's why that's why yeah, that's what bitches do. That's why I said earlier that leading the way silly women, you you're the number of silly women, man. Right. You know? And you gonna get nothing but women just like you, man. Niggas that soft like you that believe that shit, man. That shock value shit. A real man gonna be like, wait, wait, wait. They they do what? So why they out? They ain't going to jail or nothing? You know what I'm saying? That don't make no sense, man. But a whole ass nigga, if they, that's like that that the, the bitches say that's T for them. So they just sip that shit and like that shit. And they don't even question it. They just be like, oh, oh my God. Oh, that's some that's some that's some T for you right there. They probably actually use that shit. Yeah. Oh bitch ass so niggas, bad, man. Yeah. You know? It says, and ran greedily after the heir of Balaam for reward and perished in the gang saying of Koray. Yep, for reward. They're doing all this work for reward. Nate's doing what he's doing for reward, man. Zakari, all them niggas, for reward. Not reward for the most high, reward for, for the, uh, from that, that demon himself. Yeah. Okay? Riches. Fame. You know what I'm saying? Things of that nature. Power. Or whatever, man. Go ahead. These are spots in, the, in your feast of charity. When they feast with you, feeding themselves without fear. Yeah. Getting, getting down, man. Okay, want to go to Passovers. They don't care, man. They want to serve the Lord. They don't care how they getting down, man. Without fear, man. They feasting. Bringing out the scriptures. You know? But you a wicked nigga. That's why the most high said you can't come to these feasts and eat, if you eat unworthily, man. You gotta eat right. 
Yeah, I know. You gotta be in the right, right mind. Yeah, you guys. Okay. Uh, come on. Let's go ahead. I appreciate it. It says clouds they are without water, carried about of winds. Yeah, useless, man. <laughs> useless. That's like I got a, a, a book like this, but a guy got the Holy Bible in front, opening ain't nothing in there. <laughs> All blank pages, blank man. Page. And he just rambling. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? Hey, give me that precept about this and that. Hey, okay. not, not even precept, <laughs> just talking. Like, see, you know, the seed, like a woman says, yeah, my like seed, and then just making stuff up, man. <laughs> you know, you just got to hear him talk. Okay? Yes. Go ahead. It says, trees who fruit withereth without fruit. Twice dead, plucked up by the roots. Because you got stuff on the top. Yeah, yeah, we good. Yeah, I appreciate it. Not a problem. I just want to make sure. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. You guys have a wonderful day. Enjoy your weekend. And like I said, try to drink water and stay hydrated. Yeah. Don't, don't fall out or anything. Okay. I appreciate it. You guys have a wonderful day. Okay. You do. It says, trees who fruit withereth without fruit. Twice dead, plucked up by the roots. Yeah, don't have no fruit, no way to, to increase and produce in you. Okay, go ahead. Raging waves of the sea, for, uh, forming out of their own shame. Mm -hmm. Wandering stars, to whom is reserved the blackness of darkness forever. And Enoch also, the seventh from Adam, prophesied of these, saying, Behold, the Lord cometh with ten thousands of his saints to execute judgments uh, upon all and to convince all that are ungodly among them of all their ungodly deeds which they have ungodly committed. Hey, Enoch is doing the work too, you know. It don't say much, but hey, Enoch is doing the work, okay? Go ahead. And of all their uh, and of all their heard speeches which ungodly sinners have spoken against him. These are murmurers, complainers, walking after their own lust, and their mouth speaking great swelling words. Yeah, great swelling words, man. Calling the Lord's name anything saying all kind of like foolishness man you know like just great swelling words you don't care man okay go ahead having men's persons in ad admiration because of advantage yeah having yeah. men's persons in admiration because of advantage man you fucking with people because it is, is an advantage to you that's respect the persons man yeah. you know that's why i said don't uh, it says Sirach, Don't when you see a rich man dressed well, people speak well of him. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's that's you niggas, man. Like we don't care who it is, we gonna curse you out. Like the brothers in in, uh, in Arkansas is giving it to Waka Flocka, man. Face to face, uh, no, ain't no like you could be like, nah, man, you, you wicked, man. Are you doing this? America's gonna do this? No, it ain't like that. You know what I'm saying? The elders done it many times with many celebrities, man. You know? Ain't no like, oh shit, that's uh, that's busy bone. Let me, you know, bring out some scriptures about singing. Those, you know, <laughs> the Levites bring out the Levites. Yeah. Lord, yeah. see, they was bringing music. The Lord had to come listen. You know? Yeah. He probably be listening to your music. Yeah. Fuck out of here. No, man. Fuck you, man. Yes, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Says, but beloved, remember ye the what? Uh, remember ye the words which are spoken before of the apostles. Uh, of our Lord Yahweh Shah Mashiach, mm -hmm. how that they told you there there should be mockers in the last time, who should walk after their own ungodly lust. Yeah, yeah. But who with the chip on his hand? Because he he don't want to get out of here. That's he he that. love it here, so he gonna play. He's mocking right. because of his lust to be here and to be a a, a silly woman, you know. Yeah, that's right. Go ahead. These be they who separate themselves. Sensual, having not the spirit. Yeah, look at that word sensual for me. That was, uh, verse 19. We're going to wait for that. Take corner. That's what that's I think it is. Because it's the first time. <laughs> um, Strong's G5591. It says, of or belonging to breath, having the nature and characteristics of the breath, the principle of animal life, which men have in common with the brutes, governed by breath, the sensuous nature, with its subject to appetite and passion. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Look up, uh, 
Central and uh and um dictionary.com or etymology. Look up etymology. Yes. 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 was like some more soft shit, man. Yeah. Uh, it's uh, pertaining to, or in, in dictionary.com, pertaining to, or inclined to, or preoccupied with gratification of senses or appetite, carnal fleshly, lacking in moral restraints, lewd or unchaste, arousing or exciting the sense of appetites. So it's just, you just don't have a, a you greedy, man. You know what I'm saying? You just, you want party. You, you know, you don't care. You don't care about how you party, you just want to party, you want to eat, you want to have fun, you know, you want to rap, you know, you want to have long hair, you know, you sensual, you just don't, you, your appet you got an appetite. Go ahead. It says, uh, this is etymology, it says from the 15th, uh, 15th century, carnal, unspiritual, of or pertaining to the senses, uh, it says indirectly from late Latin, sensualist, endowed with feelings. <laughs> Uh, meaning connected with gratification of the senses, lewd, unchaste. It's just being extra carnal, man. Yeah. That's that hair. That's that the way you eat. You know what I'm saying? Not being able to fast, or you just can't control yourself. You don't. You don't. Can't bridle yourself, man. Yeah. You know. You, you worried about how you look and how you smell and how you feel. You just in touch yeah. with your feminine side. Yeah, and that's what. That's when we. When that's why when <laughs> we bring it. out things that are spiritual. They can't understand it because all they're doing is going off their senses. They're very carnal, man. You know? Like, you can't understand it. Like, what, what? A woman, oh, that's my daughter, man. You know? Just shut up, man. Yeah, because if you think about it, being <laughs> spiritual has nothing to do with your feelings, man. Exactly. All right? Because being spiritual is, is what the spirit is showing you. Now, when you get to you talk about feelings, that's, oh, I feel this and I know you cannot overpower what the scriptures say and the scriptures is the spirit of Yahweh Yahweh Shai man alright so none of, none of your fucking feelings matter but if you've been sensual like brother said it's been extra carnal man not our, not only are you carnal but you extra carnal to where you get in this mode of thinking that your feelings fucking matter man yeah lord yeah. don't care about your feelings man sensual niggas don't prophesy in sackcloth man yeah, they, you know they got silk purple yeah you know like, we spiritual, man. I, we 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 take pride in our our uh, out, of, out of the scriptures in the way we present ourselves, biblically. You know what I'm saying? Not visually. Okay. We ain't worried about having our lineups and all that. Mm -hmm. You know. That's been sensual, man. Cause all of that applied to the senses. How people looking at you. How they, you know what I'm saying? How they feeling about you? Like, look, we out here, like speaking. You know what I'm oh, 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 yeah. Oh. That's that's how you Theatrical being heard. And shit. You being heard and shit. You know what I'm saying? Niggas probably put baby baby oil oil on you so you could make sure you soft to the touch. You got a little powder. Yeah. On. You got a little powder. <laughs> a little powder. Verse <laughs> uh, verse twenty. But ye beloved, building up yourselves on your most holy faith. Praying in the Holy Spirit. Keep yourselves in the love of the Most High. Looking for the mercy of our Lord Yahweh Shai unto eternal life. Looking for the mercy, man. Looking for it, man. Niggas is playing with the, the mercy door. You know, you playing with it because it's on automatic right now. That motherfucker is going to lock, but you playing with it. It's like you're spinning the door. You yeah, you in, running in and just yeah, keep going in and out, keep going in and out. Like, you know what I'm saying? I go in that motherfucker. I ain't going back. I don't know when it's going to stop. Yep. You know? <laughs> yeah, kind of. Cause yeah. when you know when the spinning thing stops, you can't it's done. You can't get in and out. Ugh, ain't no pushing that yeah. nothing, man. You know? And some uh, and some have compassion making a difference. And some have compassion making a difference, man. You know? Making a difference, like I said earlier. Getting out here and doing something, man. You niggas play with mercy. Uh I wish the Lord come save me. Oh, I'm about to go to the club. Oh, Lord, you know I ain't want to go to that club. Oh, Lil Wayne coming. I'll go. Oh, Lord, you know I ain't want to go to that club. And you going in and out that door. Some having compassion making a difference, man. Fuck that. I ain't about to die. Hey, Lord coming. You know, and making a difference. You doing shit. You start to read more. 
oh, the Bible says I can't do that. Let me stop doing that shit. The Bible says I'm supposed to do this. Let me start doing that. You know? Then you become a new preacher all of a sudden. Yeah. And others, and others save with fear, pulling them out of the fire. Hating. And others save with fear, pulling them out of the fire. When you see brothers on that same path, or you see other people on the same path, you, especially when you first start, you try to pull everybody out of the fire. But you sometimes you realize niggas just like want to bake, man. You know. Go ahead. Says hating even the garment spotted by the flesh. Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy to the only wise power our Savior be glory and majesty, dominion and power now and ever. Amen. Yeah, so Yahweh Shai is the main person that's able to pull us out of that fire. Meaning he ain't just another nigga, man. You know? Not just another nigga. I'm gonna put say it like this, he ain't no Paul or no no David or no Peter. No, that's your house shy, man. Your house shy ain't just no no any dude, man. And those are prominent men. They ain't just any nigga. But they you talking about your house shy. The person bring redemption and grace back to Israel as a nation, man. Yeah. The only person that the, done the something night, around uh, around that magnitude was Moses. Friday man. Night we had a to save the nation of Israel, man. That's the only person that ever did something as doing something to the whole nation, man. You know? But Yahweh Shai is the only person that did it spiritually. There's nobody that can do it spiritually that can go to the Most High and be like, look, I got them. You know? Moses can't do it. Moses had to get captains and all that. Yahweh Shai ain't need nobody, for real, for real. He just used them, not used them, he just had them to pass along so that the work wouldn't be all in vain. You know what I'm saying? To pass so he had to have his had to have people to to do it. You know what I'm saying? Yahweh Shah could have came and just tore his motherfucker up and left. <laughs> and, and did it successfully. But that would have been it. So he had to pass on the, on that power and give it that example, man. That's it. So uh with that being said, we're gonna say call hello to your how about Shimel Shot. Double honest side apostle slash elders, which are a great millstone. Bless the salutations to all the people out here, all the Negro, Latinos, and Native Americans out here that are doing this work in Jesus' sincerity. Okay, and bless the women of the Negro, Latino, and Native American descent that's doing this in truth and sincerity. Shalom. Shalom.